Really, he thought they had now talked enough about fairies, and it struck him that Tinkerbell was keeping very quiet. "'I can't think where she has gone to,' he said, rising, and he called Tink by name. Wendy's heart went flutter with a sudden thrill. "'Peter!' she cried, clutching him. "'You don't mean to tell me that there is a fairy in this room?' "'But she was here just now,' he said a little impatiently. "'You don't hear her, do you?' And they both listened. "'The only sound I hear,' said Wendy, "'is like a tinkle of bells. "'Well, that's Tink. "'That's the fairy language. "'I think I hear it too.' The sound came from the chest of drawers, and Peter made a merry face. No one could ever look quite so merry as Peter, and the loveliest of gurgles was his laugh. He had his first laugh still.' 